So we've had a look at a handful of different tunings now, and today we're gonna look at how they stack up against each other. Every tuning has their own thing going and seem to excel in different ways. So let's hear how a handful of videos measure up when compared back to back. All right, folks, we're back, and you're gonna wanna bring your ears for this one. When comparing different videos, some of the differences may seem subtle. You know, everyone has a different threshold when it comes to hearing differences between small amounts of sense. But in the context of playing any given tuning, I think those subtle differences create an accumulated effect, which makes each of these tunings stand apart. So we're gonna be comparing 12, 19, 22, 31, 41, and 53 EDO. Every interval in each tuning approximates differently to just intonation, so, as we go through them, we'll see how flat or sharp each one is from their justly tuned counterpart of the harmonic series. So let's just start with our standard thirds here. So starting with the standard 12 tone tuning here, we'll do the major third and we'll add the fifth on there as well. And the minor thirds. So those differences may be super subtle to some of you, but as I said, there is an accumulated effect. I should note that the perfect fifth is already pretty perfect in most of these tunings, with the biggest deviations being about seven cents flat in 19 EDO, and about seven cents sharp in 22 EDO. But let's move on to some of those major sevens. Okay, starting in 12 again. And the minor seven. We got the harmonic seven, which you can actually do in 12 EDO. So the differences are starting to show. But let's check out some major nines.
some interesting subtle differences there, but let's see what we get with a C13 chord. Okay, let's toss 12 EDO aside here and see how our sub minors and super majors feel. Okay, starting with the sub minor here in 19. And the super majors. It's interesting, some of those definitely seem to work better than others but let's see what happens when we play a chord progression across all six tunings. So these all have their own feels to them. And the different characteristics of each all have their own pluses and minuses. If you're interested in playing tunings that are closer to just intonation, 41 and 53 EDO both do a fantastic job at approximating the JI, and I personally don't need anything closer. But a tuning like 22 EDO can provide some wild new territory to discover. But it's nice to have multiple tools in the shed to work with. But let me know in the comments if there's anything else you guys want to see covered, and I will try to make it happen with my limited experience. But as always, thanks to you all, and we'll see you next time.